And we're back to learning Premiere Pro and this time I'm going to show you a simple upscale bump transition. Very easy to create. All that we need are two clips. And to use these two you will find them via description link below. Place one on top of the other. Just choose a position where you've got an overlap so that we can add this transition right there where both clips are active. Go to the starting position of the first video file, which is now on video channel 2. We need the effect controls. If you can't see that, go to window, effect controls, and we need the scaling. It's now at 100%, and that fills my screen. So I'm going to use this as the basic unit. If yours is just 50 to fill the screen, you will have to cut the values in two that I'm going to use here. What important is, go to the starting position, click on this animation icon. See that right here. Then I set it to 25. So it's now at a fourth of its original size. So for example, if your video file fills the screen at 50, you will have to use 12.5. Now use the arrow keys, for example, three or four frames, and type in 50, a new keyframe is generated. Once again, use the arrow keys, three or four keyframes, 75% and then 100. So I've got four keyframes, and they scale up from a fourth to the size that fills the screen. By default, these are all linear, so if I select them and right click on them, you can see that linear is selected. We want to set it to hold so that it doesn't scale up gradually, but has this bumpy effect. It's a good idea to use music and then synchronize these keyframes according, for example, to the bass. But this is the general process of creating this upscale bump transition in Premiere Pro. I hope this video was helpful, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.